Ordinance, $100,000 a year. At the four years with a 7% cost of living, $128,000 is their salary, plus a $70,000 a year expense account. Jody Weiss coming here, $100,000. What has he done? $300,000. I'm sorry, $300,000. What has he done? That was Mayor Daly's trophy of our tax dollars, no money. What is he doing? We laid off over th nearly a thousand teachers. You were been sitting there. What is he doing? Nothing. And now we get, show you how they brainwash us and use a Romney name will come in here supposedly run. Terry Peterson go be his campaign manager. Manipulate the minds of the black folks. Put you a Negro up there. That's what Daley did as mayor. He would have got black press secretary. Terry Peterson to run his campaign the next time. To manipulate our minds. Because he know he need the black vote to win. And we got black leadership. And he get them little token positions and no power. You don't think they got power? Look at all the black department heads he got. See what we get in contracts. Less than 6 7% of the contracts. 3%. 3%. So that means when a white vendor walk out of there for every million dollar he get in contracts, black vendors only get 30000 That's what it says. That's the facts. I told you I want to know who the coach is. Go on my website. You can hear all this. Because I'm going to tell you the truth. I don't care who in office. I don't care what color it is. Our community has been pimped by our leaders. And we need to mount up in the next five months and find us a candidate for, for mayor. We need to find a candidate for aldermen and all of our black wars. We need to be on the move. And then when you get the people involved, this, let me tell you something. I can take one little match and strike it on them curtains. And guess what? It inflamed this whole building. We take this little group of people and we go word of mouth, door by door, block by block. And before you know it, you got a, a, a groundswell of people saying we won't change. We won't change. It's the grassroots people going to make a difference. I don't care if you got $20 million. That's one vote. The rest of the people still got to come out and vote. If you get 10 people to come out and vote for mayor, and that's all, all you need is six out of those 10 to win. 44%, that tells me that there's a 8% there's a, a difference in the white population, vote population, and the black population. All we have to do is get our people out to vote. That's all we have to do, but they go divide. They got them all jumping in this race. They got them all jumping in. And watch what they do. They go put three, four whites in there. At the last minute, they go drop out. It's going to be one. See, they little plan... They look plan and backfire when they went to nonpartisan elections. Uh -huh. It's backfiring on them now. That was to keep a black from being in power. But now it's backfiring because you put five, six blacks in there, white still can't get all the white votes and win. God don't like ugly, do it. So I'm the coach. Am I running? Should I run? <laughs> uh, I won't run, but I'll tell you what. I'm running for Alderman in 34th Ward. I wasn't running, but Gilda called me last over the weekend and stirred me back up. I'm running for Alderman in 34th Ward, so I'll be a boy who have been in office. They're going to have to deal with this in City Hall. I'm the coach.